Hey guys, so today I'm here with this month's Top Box Unboxing and this is July's Top Box. And I've been watching some other people's Top Box Unboxings and I'm really excited to see what's inside here because a lot of people have some really exciting things. So for those of you guys who don't know, Top Box is a Canadian subscription box. It's $13 a month and you get five random samples, very similar to Ipsy, but you also get the option to upgrade to a pre-day Top Box and that's usually brand focused. Like some of the ones I've received in the past have been from Benefit or Makeup Forever. Um, and they're usually larger sized luxe samples with a high value. And actually for this month, we got our August wish list and it was amazing. Like there was so many good top boxes to choose from. I wishlisted for a Bobbi Brown top box, which had like her new concealer in it, which is like a $38 value. Fingers crossed I get that one. You guys will see next month. I don't think I wishlisted for any of them last month. So I think I just went with a regular top box. So let's see what's inside. This is heavy. So. Uh, not inside the bag was this little Garnier Skin Active Moisture Balm. So I think this was like a little additional sample. I think it was only like two months ago that I had the Garnier Micellar Water Mini. So that's super cool. Oh, this feels really nice. I love these kind of gel creams. It has a very strong fragrance so it's but it's a fresh scent which is nice but if you're irritated by fragrance i don't know that's pretty intense and then we're going to get inside the actual top box so the first couple things i just noticed in here are super exciting because i've always wanted to try this brand so i've never tried anything from purology before they're very expensive shampoo and conditioners um, so let's see, this is the Perfect for Platinum Shampoo Concentrated Formula for color treated hair with four or more levels of lift. No idea what that means. I did just get my hair colored. Someone in the comments below who knows stuff about hair dye, <laughs> like let me know because I don't have a clue. Oh, it smells really nice. It has like a fruity scent, which I love. Next up, I have this Barefoot Venus Honey Mango Macadamia Oil Hand Cream. Oh, that's exciting. This is made with macadamia nut, sweet almond oil, elderflower extract, and silk amino acids. Feels really nice. Oh my gosh. It smells delicious. It smells like summer pina coladas. Always need a good hand cream. It's not something that I pick up for myself. And then next up, I have a liquid lipstick from Loritzi. I think that's how it's pronounced. And this is their Undressed Liquid Lip Stain. This is in the shade Pebble. I guess I would call that a rosy red with a hint of brown. So there's the shade there. That's really pretty. I kinda wanna try it on and see what it looks like. It has a really thin formula. I guess that's why it's undressed. And there we go, what do you guys think? I like it. I don't think I have a color like this in my collection, so that's kinda cool. It doesn't feel sticky, which is nice, and yeah, I think it's drying down nicely. So, oh, this is cool, I like this. And then we have a sample of Glam Glow. So this is the Super Mud Clearing Treatment. And I think this is one of the most popular masks. I'm not totally up to date with Glam Glow. I, the only time I really use it is when I get a sample, but every time I've tried it, it's been amazing. So this is awesome to have. I think so far any time I've gotten Glam Glow has been with Top Box, which is amazing. This really deep cleans your pores. And it has, I think it's like seaweed to help exfoliate your face. So that is everything for this month's top box. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So next month is going to be really exciting. So I hope you guys stay tuned. I'm bringing in a little something back. And if you guys have been around for a long time, you'll easily be able to guess what this is. So let me know in the comments below if you guys know what video series I'm bringing back. 100 points to whoever guesses it right. And don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Instagram at Making Up Ashley. And I'll be talking to you guys soon. Bye.